What's up Coffee Explorer? Today in this video we're gonna take a look at some coffee companies that are putting their money where their mouth is to do some real change in the world not only in the coffee industry but also to combat pollution and climate change. If you're interested and you want to subscribe and comment below for a chance to win a signed copy of my book Tales of a Traveling Coffeepreneur A Journey to Find the World's Best Coffee and also a possibility of winning a 12 ounce bag of Vietnamese Highland Arabica. Uh, just some amazing coffee, you're gonna love it from Sassy's Exquisite. Subscribe, like, comment, share, and help us get our subscriber count up to at least 100. Uh, that way I can get a uh, personalized uh, URL for my YouTube channel here. Uh, that would be awesome, but Here's the video. Hi, I'm Ario from Indonesia. We produce uh, Sumatra Gayu coffee. Uh, this is a special coffee because we grew it in a volcanic areas. So you get this uh, earthy, spicy and fruity notes in it. I mean, come, uh, come to our farm, try our coffee there. Definitely you will be satisfied. I'm Dan Maurer. I'm a co-founder and co-director of Elevate Nepal Incorporated. We're a Flagstaff-based, uh, Flagstaff, Arizona-based nonprofit organization. We do relief work over in Nepal, mostly aiding to victims of the 2015 earthquake, rebuild schools, homes, sanitation systems. Uh, last July, July of 2018, we started importing Nepalese coffee, one of few importers of Nepalese coffee into America, and all the proceeds go back to Nepal to help fund humanitarian efforts over there. This is a very clean, low, uh, low acidity cup, nice smooth finish, very chocolatey with some nutty undertones. It's a great coffee, Sapana coffee, you can buy it today at elevatenepal.org. Hi everyone, I'm Yao Wenyuan. I come from China and uh, I don't know how many of you has uh, been familiar with China coffee but we have been planting coffee for over a hundred of years and recently we have been doing a lot of effort in growing specialty coffee because the um, commercial coffee is tied too closely to the New York City market Due to this low price, the local farmers, they are not earning good life. So we want to do um, quality improvement and in recent years we have been uh, showing a good performance in scratch coffee, I think. Uh, last year, China is the portrait country of SC Expo. And this year we're here again at Boston. So please um, come and uh, 
have a good taste of China coffee. We want every one of you know China coffee and to know more and to really taste and we want you to really love China coffee. Thank you. Yeah, so this is a new product that's a single serve on a stick and it comes in different shapes and forms and sizes that can be just dropped into hot water. It's very rapid dissolved. It's pure coffee. There's no additives, no preservatives, no other ingredients and it retains all of the aromatic oils so that the flavors retain in these individual servings. So it's, it's very uh, lightweight, very portable, and it uh, is very tasty. It's simple to use on the go. It basically doesn't have any waste like K-Cups that's 50 to 100 million a day going into the trash. Uh, it's very easy to transport. So it's a very green product in the sense of green and healthy and uh, just good tasting coffee and it's simple and easy and quick. And uh, we're just introducing it at the show and uh, we're looking to partner up with uh, companies who want to work with us on a licensing agreement for our patented purpose. Uh, we will not be selling it to the public. We're just going to be working with a, a larger group or any group that has the resources that wants to do this, then we'll license it to them and they can put it into the marketplace. I think it's a fantastic product and I've just tasted it and as far as instant coffee goes, it blows everything I've ever tasted out of the water. So. Well, it's a, it's a process I developed about 25 years ago in a different industry and I realized one day that, gee, I bet that would work in this industry in the coffee business and uh, started out about three years ago to develop the process. So it's uh, it's like an instant coffee, but it's it's really a different process than uh, instant coffee. Uh, and it, that's why it retains all of the aromatic oils. This is where K-Cups and everything, that ground coffee, it loses most of the aromatic oils in a couple of days. So it's really kind of dead coffee in those containers and then you're brewing in a plastic container uh, and you've got all that waste and stuff is where this is just pure. It's just solid, pure coffee with no additives. All right, awesome. So if, uh, if there's a business that wants to work with you, uh, how can they get a hold of you? Uh, they, can, they can contact us online at our website, quickcoffee.com, and that's with K's. And our phone number is Right here, they can contact us that way or email us, or they can leave a message on our website. Right, well, thank you very much for your time. Thank you.